Indian ancient math gives us classical ways to add, subtract, multiply and divide. But there is a Japanese way of multiplying numbers easily. We shall discuss here to use this method for 2 to 3 digit multiplication. For example let us multiply 12 times 13. In 12 we draw one line. After leaving a gap, draw two parallel lines. In 13 we draw one perpendicular line. And after giving a gap draw three parallel lines. To calculate the product, we just need to count how many times all of the lines intersect and write each number under the place as. Hence the final product as 156. Let us take for example 24 times 5. In 24 we draw two lines. After leaving a gap, draw four parallel lines. In 5 we draw 5 perpendicular parallel lines. To calculate the product, we just need to count how many times all of the lines intersect. Count on one's place is 20. We take it as 0. 2 taken to carry. Added to count on 10's place we get 10 plus 2 equals 12. So the final product is 120. Let us take another example 32 times 17 we draw 3 lines. After leaving a gap, draw 2 parallel lines. Similarly draw 1 line perpendicular. Leave a gap draw 7 parallel lines. To calculate the product, we just need to count. How many times all of the lines intersect? Count on 1's place as 14 we take it as 4. 1 taken to carry. Added to count on 10's place. We get 23 plus 1 equals 24. We take it as 4. 2 taken to carry. Count on 100's place as 3. Added to get 5. So finally number is 544. Let us take multiplication of 3 digit numbers as. For example 212 times 315. Draw 212 as red lines. Draw 315 as blue lines to calculate the product. We just need to count how many times all of the lines intersect. Count on 1's place is 10 we take it as 0. 1 taken to carry. Added to count on next loop we get 7 plus 1 equals 8. Count on next loop is 17. Take it as 7 1 taken to carry. Count on next loop 5 plus 1 equals 6. Count on last loop is 6. So finally number is 66,780. At last here is an example try to reach it by your memory.